Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel today for another replay. What I got for you today is a game that I played with the T54 Lightweight and we are going to be taking a look at it. So this is going to be part of my light tank week where I'm going to be showing off all the new light tanks, or not really new light tanks, but rebalanced light tanks at their new tiers since tier 54 was or used to be tier 8. So as you see, this matchmaking is absolutely brutal. I'm totally top tier, one of three tier nines, so that just means that I'm gonna be, that I'm gonna be playing aggressive as hell throughout the entire game. So what you always want to do on Tundra, I guess it's standard, and I keep saying that, I keep repeating that on streams and everywhere. Please take the hill, please take the hill, especially in a fast tank. The hill is so important. If you look at it, it's such a strategically important point. You can control like over half of the map from there. You can shoot down, you can spot, you can just you, you can just um, dominate from up there. So this is why the hill is so fucking important. But yeah, people tend to not realize this lots of times, so yeah, sometimes it annoys me a bit. So what you see our team doing here, Heavy is going 1-2 line. The problem with 1-2 line, you're just pinned down there, RT can uh, rain down on you and they can just heavy tanks or TDs camp in the back here and you cannot really push up, so this is why I totally hate going 1-2 line. You'll have a better game going hill, even in the heavy, um, or trying to play it through the middle somehow, but 1-2 line, not so good. Maybe if there is no RT, but in this case 3 altas, not so good. So what you see me doing here, I'm already up to 1k damage, aggressively push the hill, we managed to push out the 3090. Um, now there is this Skoda T34 100 here, I tried to play on him, but then an STA appears as well. So I decide like, um, yeah, fuck off, I'll let these guys do there. And I'm just um, gonna see what I can do here on the hill. I see that there's a T25 too that has pushed around, and it looks like a perfect, perfect breakfast for me. So this is what I'm gonna do next. Uh, see, I shoot down, check my surrounding if there's anyone shooting at me. You see I'm aiming at this track wheel, so I keep him tracked. There's nothing really aiming at me, so I can slowly make these shots, fully aim and stuff. And now you see what's the best thing about the lightweight. I got ramming skilled on it as well. And just look, it's 3090. He doesn't see me coming. So yeah, I ram him for, how much was that? I ram him for 500 damage and finish him off with a quick HE shell into the side for 260. And that's how quickly you can uh, take out other light tanks with that T54 lightweight. And it's a stay 2 just yellowing in. Yeah, no idea what he did. So yeah, 5-0 the score after just two and a half minutes. We completely secured um, the east side of the map here. And yeah, you see the enemies with their heavies stuck on the one line. Not really um, going well for them, for either team. It's just like some back and forth there, nothing really happening. And I'm just gonna go to town at the Tiger 1 here. Poor tier 7 heavy, and I keep saying that as well. Tier 9 mediums against tier 7 heavy tanks, that's just not fair. Especially on distance, that's, that's even more unfair. Like, they have no chance to spot you, the armor is so bad, you can just auto-pen them pretty much. And yeah, even with the lightweight like this, you can um, try to play with your armor against those heavies. Uh, which can work, you see I'm playing cooldown here, the Tiger P doesn't really have a shot at me or it cannot really pen me. And that's the biggest strength about this um, T54 light. You, you can just play it ultra aggressively, because you have that bit of turret armor, a bit of hull armor, and you just have uh, this ramming capability which makes you ultra, ultra dangerous against other light tanks. So yeah, just taking out this uh, Tiger here. Or trying to. Yeah, he already died. And now it's just a matter of cleaning up these heavies to end this game. I have 3 there again. I have time to aim, so I might as well just fully aim it. Track him. So if he gets shot now, I'll get the assistance as well. There we go. 328 assistance. I pick him up here. Now it's only this KV3 left. Again, I have time to aim. Don't want to hit an ally here. Another shot into him. And you see that puts me up to almost 5.2k damage. That's how quickly it just goes with these um, light tanks. If you just play ultra aggressively, and this is exactly what the T54 lightweight allows it to do, and this is why I love this tank so much. You can just rape everything, especially low tiers and other light tanks. Yeah, now it's only this Ata. Left here, Panther misses his shot, only tracks him, and I take him out. That's the game. GG, easy!